Kenny was probably the first person that called me um, after after I got drafted, and I didn't really I didn't know who he was at all. Um, and I think you know our relationship now is 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 great, and I think he pushes me each and every day. Nice pace, nice pace. That's it. Good, good. Yes, yes. Good stuff. Good job, Jay. Great job. He knows that I want to work hard. He knows that, and sometimes I need the extra push, and he's there every step of the way to help me with that. Hey, this is where we want to put him. This is the worst PPP in the league. Put him right here on the hash mark. Go. Kenny's crazy, man. <laughs> I love Kenny. He's super intense. He's uh, he's hard nosed. He gets he gets in there and, and practices with us, which I think is, which is kind of crazy. Like, um, because he's he, he's not a small guy, but he's smaller than we are. Hold on, let me get this one. Yeah, break it. He's tough, and you can see the intensity on his face and how much he cares about winning and, and, and competing. Can you guys get to the paint on them? Next one off the dribble. Back up a little. Roll it to him. You're in an ISO situation. Same thing. No middle, no paint. Don't let him get to the paint. Oh. Kenny's super cool, man. He, he makes you feel like you can uh, go out there and make mistakes, and you have the leash to learn. And um, as a player, that's all you ever really want. No one's closed it out yet. No one wants to get three stops in a row to close out the game so we can get out of here. You got something? Yep. yep. I can connect with this man. I can connect. He's, he's here for a reason to teach me in ways of how to be very patient and not be too overzealous to get goals done in the first five games or the first ten. Like, no, it's a long haul. And to me, that's just mix it in. That's, that's going to be a feel, right? Between me, point guards, guard, we're just going to feel this. Could be end of game, could be after a free throw, dead ball. I just think his attention to detail is, is big. And I think for any coach, if you're locked in and you, you understand the players and understand the game, it just makes for a better relationship for, for everyone. And I think that he's done a great job with that. <laughs> Remember, you, you ran wide, Spencer had to pick you up, and then you... We just didn't throw it to you. Oh, man, it's intense. Um, <laughs> I love it, though. Um, he's real on point. Attention to detail. Um, he expects a lot of his players. And um, he also listens to our feedback. And um, I think that goes a long way. In. Ooh, I like that. I like that. Play. I like that. Read the game. Good read. He's one of the hardest working guys I've ever been around. He's in here every day, 5.30, 6 a.m. It doesn't matter if it's the off season or during the season. Just continually trying to get better. He's constantly thinking about his guys, showing that he cares. Good, Joe! Good, Joe! Tackle him, Joe! Great job! Uh, he'll be hard on you, and then, like, in an instant, like, he'll be nice. <laughs> like, <laughs> like he'll, be, he'll tell you that you're good, you know, you're doing well, but then he'll, like, cuss you out, like, two seconds later. But it's like, that's him. He wants to see you succeed, and, like, he has that coach's mentality of the literally next play, even if the play before was good. No middle is off! Up top, between the elbows, no middle is off! Contain and contest! Keep him out of the paint! Force a non-paint two. Very, very competitive coach. Um, he's a player's coach. Um, someone who puts an, an emphasis on winning and doing things the right way, winning the right way, um, and kind of having your spirit right each and every day. He kind of preaches that, um, having the right spirit, um, and that'll kind of win in the long run. Keep building our foundation, all right? Remember what we talked about? Kind of build on last season. Last season, we were average. We got to take here and go to here, and maybe take another step and go to here. So what does that mean? We have to do things better than we ever did them before. You know, Kenny's the type of guy where, you know, he, he's going to shoot you just a, a random text just to check in and see how you're doing, uh, you know, give you a call here and there. It's just that transparency, that rapport that not a lot of NBA coaches have. Let's bring it in. Here we go. Yeah. TP, what do you got? One, two, three. One, two, three.